Melbourne victory on both occasions. So Danzaki, he's in behind Riku Danzaki. Well, that's a critical save from Joe Gauchi. He saved the day in the shootout against City, and he's doing so early on here. Austin swinging it out, and in front of Mila Uznic, who's moved from the left to the right. Can he get onto that left boot, Nikola Mila Uznic? And now O'Shea, Jay O'Shea, with a special strike. Well, he said last season he wanted to score more from open play. Well, hasn't he answered that? What a strike. So Jay O'Shea on the corner. And Charlie Austin, he gets on the board for Brisbane Raw. The new recruit strikes to make it 2-0. Dorigo bending it. Bernardo linking with Halloran. Returns it to Bernardo. The deflection is going to favour the Reds. And they are back right before half time. That's all it takes is that deflection and Nibisuki there. The striker, the poacher, able to be there anticipating the second ball and breathing some life back into. Adelaide United's quarter-final fixture. Leaving a boot in. And the Reds moving it quickly, and it was Ryan Kitto on the volley. He angles the cross towards Ibasuki. He's going to track it down. And the whistle goes against the Japanese import. He's saying he got the ball. So too is Isaias, and it's a red card. So the Reds seeing red all of a sudden. Just these half opportunities, not falling the way of the Reds at the moment. Here's a chance for Isaias! And if it had have gone in, Joe Gauci and Constantopoulos, his first touch. Cavallo urged to shoot. Kito, down he goes! Tim Danaskis says no penalty, and Cavallo's volley has come very, very close. Chapman has got an arm around him there. Look, he's already... Or he's falling that way. He's already, I won't say he's falling. He's turning in that direction. Cavallo, a cross shot into the side netting. Freak was worried about it because it would have been a freakish goal from Josh Cavallo. And Brisbane Raw, they are through to the final four for the first time in club history.